welcome back to my channel. So I'm super excited for today's video because I'm doing a haul and you guys are always asking me to do fashion related videos and I'm always shopping so it's kind of like a win-win. This is 100% a collective haul. It's things that I've bought over a period of time. I didn't just go out in one day and buy all of these things. So yeah, it's just like some of my recent summer purchases or work purchases. Most of it is from Kate Spade and Madewell. Um, in case you guys missed the Q&A video that I posted recently, I actually got a job working at Kate Spade. So all the Kate Spade stuff has either been bought with my employee discount or it's been things that um, I've gotten through wardrobing, which they do every once in a while, which is so awesome. At the end of this video, I'm actually going to be showing you guys things that I'm showing on Poshmark as well because obviously I shop a lot and I'm just like really interested in fashion and everything. So with Poshmark, it's really easy for me to like kind of clear out my closet and get rid of things that I'm not wearing anymore that don't fit me. Keep an eye out for that stuff at the end of the video, but I'll also put a link in the description box for you guys to just go ahead and download Poshmark and create your own closet in case you don't already have it on your phone. So I have everything kind of piled up behind me. You can kind of see it. Um, on my bed here. So the first thing that I'm showing you guys is actually the shirt that I was wearing in the last video that I posted, my summer makeup one. And I have just been, I feel like, gravitating towards a lot of yellow things recently. I just think it's so fun and happy for summer. And I got this from Urban Outfitters, and I don't typically shop there. Um, so I was just like really happy when I found this, and it was on clearance. So it's just all around a good purchase. Then I have another cute little summer top and this one I've definitely worn in a video and posted on an Instagram. This was one of my Madewell purchases but it's just this cute little tank top that has the ruffle on the bottom and then the tank top straps are actually just like little ruffles made out of the fabric. So I just feel like this is so cute and like I'll tie a little bandana in my hair um, and wear it with like white jeans and stuff. So I just think this is like the perfect summer tank top. And then this next item actually isn't like super summery but it's one of the things that I bought when I started working at Kate Spade. It's this polka dot sweater. It's just like a white creamy color. It has three quarter sleeves. I won't be wearing this a ton throughout the summer but I just feel like all around it's a really good just like basic sweater to own. And then this again is from Kate Spade. This is just like a basic cotton t-shirt. It has the ruched detail on the sleeves. Um, but I just got this again to have something super basic that was easy for me to wear either with jeans or skirts. Um, I can wear it to work at Kate Spade, but it's also like really casual and it's easy for me to just like throw on with any outfit. So this I love and it's really, really comfy. Then I have another one of the tops that I bought when I was shopping at Madewell. This one is like a short sleeve collared button down shirt. And this one's cool because it has the vertical stripes on it and the stripes just get like thicker as they move down the shirt. But one of my favorite details on it is actually that there's like floral going with the button. And I just feel like that's like a cute little detail that doesn't really make that big of a difference But to me, I just I really like the way that looks. I don't know And then the next shirt that I'm showing you guys is again from Madewell um, It's a like button-down short sleeve shirt, but this one obviously has the big checkered gingham print um, But this one's kind of cute because it has like the little ruffle going around the hem of the shirt And then the next thing that I'm showing you guys actually isn't a new purchase But I cut the hem off of my white jeans and it has been like one of the best fashion decisions that I've made recently. So I just like literally <laughs> cut them off and gave them that raw hem and I love them so much more than I did before. I've had these jeans for like four or five years now and I was never like obsessed with the way that they fit me. So I was kind of thinking about like selling them or getting rid of them but I figured like what the heck if I'm getting rid of them anyways I might as well just like take a chance and try doing something to them. Um, so yeah, I'm so happy that I did that. I just like cut them and I took like tweezers and I actually used like a nail file to kind of like scruff it up a little bit. And then after you just like wash them and put them in the dryer, that freeze them even more so yeah I'm so obsessed with the way that these fit so I kind of wanted to just like throw that in there it's not really a new thing but I took something old and I made it new I have a lot of dresses to show you so the first one was from my Madewell trip and this I absolutely love it's like such an effortless feminine I don't know I just really love it so it's this like golden mustard color and it's a short sleeve dress but it's like a mid-length one and it just has the eyelet detail all over it and I just love the way that this fits. So then this next dress was actually a Target find, but I didn't already own a denim dress. So I just thought that this was like super cute. Um, I think for like the 4th of July or something, this would be really, really pretty. And it's very, very flattering when it's on. So yeah, I was just really excited when I saw this. I feel like it's kind of 
70s I don't know correct me if you don't think so and then this dress from Madewell it's kind of old-fashioned looking and whenever I wear dresses like this my sister always says like oh grandma called she wants her nightgown back but I don't know I, there was just something about it that I loved it really reminds me of Julia Engel who I have talked about so many times on my channel and on my Instagram I've just I have a huge girl crush on her and I aspire to be her this one I haven't gotten a chance to wear yet maybe I'll wear it tonight because Alex Yes, Alex is a boy. Him and I were talking about going to see a movie and like going out to dinner, so maybe I'll wear this one tonight. Also, speaking of Alex, he's gonna be in the next video that I post, so uh, you might wanna turn on your post notifications. Then, for the rest of the clothing items that I'm gonna be showing you guys, they're gonna be the Kate Spade things. There is a handful of stuff, but like I said, everything has either been bought with my employee discount or it's been given to me through wardrobing. Um, but the first dress that I wanna show you guys is like one of my favorite clothing items. That I own, as soon as I started working there and I saw this dress, I was just head over heels for it. I knew that it was gonna be one of the first things that I bought. So it's this white dress and it's almost a maxi. It's a little bit more of like a midi length, but depending on how tall you are, it might be a midi or a maxi. But it has this ruffle detail on the front and then it has this, this like big full tiered skirt. It's not that full. Don't like be alarmed or anything. But like I said, just as soon as I saw this dress, I was so obsessed with it. And then the next one is actually part of our new July collection. So it's this black little mini dress um, and it has all these white spots on it. But each of the white spots has this little like magenta border going around it. And this dress is super flattering on. It has like a little bit of a flare at the end um, and it has some like piping kind of going down the front that gives it a little bit more shape and then the next two items that I'm showing you guys are obviously very very similar so this one I got for wardrobing and then this one I bought for myself not knowing that I was gonna be getting this one for wardrobing so I'm not complaining I think that they're both super cute but the first thing is actually a jumpsuit that like ties up the waist so the top of it is actually like a tank top um, and then it's just a regular old jumpsuit this one definitely has more of a midi length to it as well but this is the only jumpsuit that I own and it definitely got me hooked I want to buy more because I just feel like they're so fun the dress that I have in that print is really really pretty it has more of like the flowy sleeves um it's a little bit more like romantic I think yeah this one's really really comfy as well because the back of it is actually like elastic so it's really stretchy and if you're wearing it for a long day it's just like so comfy and then this last dress that I got is this really really light pale pink tweed dress and it has little like purple and yellow specks in it this one I just think I'll get so much wear out of I've already worn it a handful of times and I kind of feel like I belong in Legally Blonde or something when I wear this dress, but I just think it's so, so feminine and pretty. So that is it for all of the clothing items that I was going to show you guys, but I got a few pairs of shoes as well. So the first ones are these little espadrilles, and these are from Kate Spade. They're white with like the laser cut eyelet. I don't know what you want to call that, but it has like all the detail across the toes. These are so, so comfortable. They have a lot of cushion on the bottom, which is awesome. So I wear these to work all the time, but they just look really cute with jeans or dresses. Um, and I got white because they're super versatile, but they came in black as well. And then a pair of shoes that I had wanted for so long. These are the Saludos Lace Up Espadrille Wedges. You guys have probably seen so many people wear these on Instagram or just like other forms of social media, probably like Pinterest. Um, but yeah, I'd wanted these for so long, so I finally just like caved and bought them. And I've gotten so much wear out of these, even though I'm not typically a heel or wedge type of person because they're still like really casual. Um, and I don't think that the heel is like that high. But then good old Target coming through with sandals. I'm always buying shoes from Target. So these ones I've definitely gotten more wear out of. They're just like a nude color. They have a little tiny block heel on them there's like a strappy shoe and I would wanted a pair like this because I feel like they're a little bit more dressy of a sandal but they're not quite a heel so they're like perfect in between so these obviously like you can see the wear on them they've gotten a lot of use and then it was buy one get one half off so I also just grabbed this pair again I feel like you can't really go wrong with a brown leather sandals and I sold my Tory Burch sandals on Poshmark last year or maybe like earlier this year so I didn't really have a pair of sandals that were that brown leather so these have kind of been tying me over but I definitely want to buy a new pair of the Tory Burch ones and then again from Target I got two pairs of earrings so this first pair are these like half hoops that have the pearls on them I was wearing these in a video that I posted recently I wonder 
feel like they're kind of like cute with what I'm wearing right now, but I didn't want to wear earrings since the headband that I'm wearing obviously is covered in pearls and I wasn't trying to like go overboard with it. And then this other pair that I got is a little bit different from what I would typically wear, but they're like this tortoise circle that has like a gold square um that's on the part that actually like goes into your ear so yeah i got both of those i think that when i bought these ones as well they were buy one get one half off but you know target you just can't go wrong with target okay like i said earlier i'm also going to be showing you guys some of the things that i'm selling on poshmark and i love poshmark it's literally the easiest way for me to clean out my closet so every once in a while i'll go through and i get, like put some stuff in a donate pile i put some stuff in a sell pile so first of all I hope that some of you guys need jeans because I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. I have five pairs of jeans that I'm selling and they're all only going to be 10 bucks. So definitely check out the jeans if you need some new ones. Also, I have this J. Crew sweater that I'm going to be selling. I just never got around to wearing it. It still has the tags. It is literally brand new. Um, and it's nautical, so that would be super, super cute for summer. I also have some athletic clothing that I'm going to be selling. So, like, I have these Under Armour shorts, a pair of leggings that are, like, a dark gray color that have the yellow little, like, stripe on the side. If you need some, like, good shorts to wear in the summer, I have this pink pair from Loft. I love this color. They just don't really fit me anymore. I know it's summer, but I do have some sweaters that I'm selling, so... Yeah, definitely go ahead and check out my closet. I know that's only some of the things, but I literally have so much stuff. I have button downs. I'm going to have some shoes that I'm selling. Like, I just want to clear out my closets because, obviously, I can't stop shopping. Um, so I got to make room for all the new stuff that's coming in. Also, I put a lot of, like, care into the packages that I send out. So I, like, wrap them up nicely, and I always put a handwritten thank you note inside of the orders. I just feel like that makes it a lot more personable. And, like, I know that a lot of the people that buy my clothes are people that watch my videos. So I always just like to add little cute touches like that into my packages yeah I will like I said have the link that way you guys can go ahead and just download Poshmark and you can start your own closet and check out the stuff that I'm selling yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video I know that you always love when I do like outfit related things so I hope that you guys enjoyed it yeah I'm just rambling at this point so I love you guys thank you for watching and I will talk to you in my next video bye